Tom Hunt. Thank you very much. Very, very, very brief. I mean, Churchill is the, the sort of the great thing the left aim for, and there's a reason for that. Churchill is at the core of why many people feel proud to be British, the Churchillian spirit. If they can take him down, if they can redefine him, what's to stop them? We must not allow it to happen, and Churchill College should hang their heads in shame yeah. for the way they allowed his legacy to be questioned the way they did. I do think it's um, it, it, wonderful speech by honourable friend member for Orpington. But this is not just a matter for London MPs. It's our nation's capital. And the heritage of London is our nation's heritage. So despite being criticised by some uh, Labour councillors from my patch for getting involved in a debate about memorials and statues in London, I will continue to do so. And I make no apology for that. Because the reality is, and we saw it this week, we saw it this week in the Peace and Crime Bill, which, and I'm glad, I'm glad that we've increased the punishment for those who desecrate and damage our war memorials and statues. But we've seen, in a way, the Labour Party sought to ridicule that. The fact that they are no longer, they have ceased to be a patriotic party. And quite frankly, you are more likely to see its leader on his knees apologising for our country's past and heritage rather than proudly standing up for it as the greatest country in the world like my war friend, a member for orbiting, has wonderfully done right now. So I'll keep my comments at that, short, punchy, and hopefully patriotic. Thank you very much, Mandit, for speaking. Yeah. Yeah.